Designing between down VS synthetic insulation is one of the most frequent choices backpackers face. Sleeping bag insulation can make or break a trip. It's hard to get a good night's sleep when you're cold and it's hard to enjoy your journey when you don't sleep well. Careful consideration and research should go into your decision. We are here to help you choose the right one for your needs. This video will guide you to reach your final decision. It covers the merits and demerits of both down and synthetic fill, the best environments for each, and more. So, without further ado, let's get started. Down Insulatan Highlights of Down Insulatan Compressible Down sleeping bags can be easily compressed into a stuffed sack, much more so than synthetic sleeping bags. Between that and their lightweight, it's easy to see why down sleeping bags are favored amongst backpackers. Lightweight, its warmth to weight ratio is unbeatable too. It takes much less down than synthetic material to fill the same area because it lofts more, and it insulates better due to its structure of fine. Branch filaments. This is also why down bags are so light compared to synthetic ones. Better warmth with proper care. Down is also much more likely to keep you warm for years to come. Decades, even. So, if you're looking to keep the same bag for a while, you can't beat down. It's a worthwhile investment. Drawback does not insulate once wet. The biggest drawback of the down is its inability to insulate once it gets wet. This can create issues if you frequent rainy or damp areas. This is especially true if you prefer tarp camping and get caught in heavy rain. For dry, cold conditions, many hikers still prefer down. Compressed parts can create chilly spots. Another downfall of the down is that compressed areas can create cold spots. The best way to deal with these is by having another insulating layer. Most people use a foam pad or inflatable sleeping pad. What I asked fill power? You will likely come across this term when researching down sleeping bags. And if this is new territory, it can be confusing. Fill power is the measurement taken in labs to determine how much loft down has. This also determines how well it can trap heat. The measurement shows how many cubic inches it takes one ounce of down to fill. Therefore, 800 fill power down fills 800 cubic inches of space with one ounce. Synthetic Insulatan Highlights of Synthetic Insulatan Still insulates when wet One of the major perks of synthetic sleeping bags is the fact that they are still able to insulate when wet. Obviously, if it's very damp or soaked it won't matter what material a bag is made of, you'll have a bad, cold time either way. But, wet synthetic bags will still provide you more warmth than wet down synthetic bags and also dry much quicker than down ones. This can get you packed up or into a warmer sleeping arrangement sooner if your bag has gotten wet along the way. It's also nice to shave some time off of the cleaning process at home. Drawmax, less compressible, unfortunately. Synthetic bags do not compress nearly as well as their down counterparts. This is due to the construction of its fibers. Again, you need more synthetic material to fill the same space compared to down. This makes most synthetic bags heavier and stiffer. Less durable, synthetic fibers also tend to break down faster over time. Therefore, they are not as durable as down bags. Leaving a synthetic bag compressed for long periods can also negatively affect its longevity. You should expect a synthetic bag to see deterioration within 5-7 years. Continuous filament or short staple? When researching synthetic bags, you might also want to check whether it's made with continuous filament or short staple. In a nutshell, a continuous filament is made of long strands of varying widths weaved together. This provides high loft and durability. Comparing two strong competitors is not just an easy task. However, we've done a little. But choose according to your preferences. This video is just to help over the topic. Hope this video helped you out. Thanks for watching till the end.